Hello Clock Jordan Circus Club and everyone else is following us. Welcome to another episode of Freestyle Football Learning with me, Sam Llewellyn. Whoop whoop. Today's first trick is called the number four. I call it that because it hits four points. Knee, knee, foot, foot. Nice. So let's break it down, starting with knee and foot. Do that a couple of times, and then going on to knee, foot, and foot. And if you can, try and get used to working on your other side. Then I like to work on knee, knee, foot. Just remember that you're gonna try and put the ball nice and high with your knee. So don't let the knee drop, or it goes forwards. Or if your knee's too high, well, this could happen. This is probably the trickiest bit, going from foot up to knee. It takes a bit of time, but just make sure that when you do your kick up, it's high enough so your knee can get underneath it. Now that you're ready, give it a go, and if you get it, I want to see that celebration. Ah yeah! A nice variation of this trick is doing the bounced leg around, which we learned in episode two. Next up, we have chest rolls, and they look like this. The ball is gonna go up the arm, across the chest, and down to the other side. You wanna lean back just a little, and keeping the ball on the inside of the arms, so it doesn't fall off. We start off and we're just going to put the ball at the top of the chest and rolling it down. And then just adding in just a little bit more distance. And when you're comfortable, you're going to just try it. Give it a go. Remember to lean back, keep the ball on the inside of the arm so it doesn't fall off. When learning continuous, I find it easier if I turn my hand over. It allows the ball just to roll a little smoother and a little faster. Nice. A nice variation of this is going from the next stall. We learned this in episode three. You're just gonna drop your shoulder and allow the ball to stay on the inside of the arm and roll around. Challenge time! Number one. Number Play safe and see you next time. Ciao!